is in Southeast Asia and is a popular tourist destination. The country is best known for its idyllic beaches and ancient temples. Tourism is a powerful force here, accounting for 20.2% of Thailand's GDP. 16 million foreign travelers visit Thailand each year. Thailand is Asia's prime destination to visit. However, Thailand's influx of tourism has had ma massive negative effects on the country as a whole. Thailand's wildlife and environment has seen negative impacts from tourism. Tourists want to see exotic animals while on holiday. Because of this, animals have been trained to amuse tourists. This has resulted in a lot of negative animal welfare taking place. Beaches have been impacted because of mass usage. Litter is also a big issue on Thai beaches. Erosion has been seen to footpaths and roads. This has led to non-integrated tourism complexes. Local people have also seen negative impacts from tourism. Inflation has taken place, resulting in prices rising due to wealthy tourists. Locals struggle to pay for necessities. Noise pollution has occurred due to increased flights, construction and nightlife. This is ruining the atmosphere for both locals and tourists. While the Thai tour tourism industry markets the country's unique cultures, the commercialization of the traditions has resulted in its corruption. Also, interaction between the Thai people and tourists has resulted in the modernization of the community. New values, behaviors and attitudes are being introduced which have resulted in the disintegration of the family unit. A polarization of social structures and income inequalities can be seen throughout Thailand. There is uneven distribution of wealth brought by tourism. Most of the revenue brought by tourism is being leaked out by big tourism corporations that dominate the market. A study of tourism in Thailand recently estimated that 70% of all money spent by tourists ends up leaving Thailand. Many of these reasons have led to crime and drug use increasing, which has had negative effects on people's view of Thailand. There is also only half a year of tourism in Thailand. Many Thais don't have jobs in monsoon season. This has led to mass unemployment when tourists are not traveling. This mass unemployment and inequality has led to prostitution, drugs, gambling and other social pathological activities taking place. This has negative effects on people's view of Thailand and, more importantly, the community as a whole. Tourism has exposed Thailand's unrested government, which in turn has created instability in tourism. This has resulted in a loss of revenue from those tourists who have concerns over crime. Tourism promotion has also been aimed largely at quantity rather than quality. This has resulted in overpopulations of certain areas. For Thailand to deal with its problems, a sustainable method of tourism must be put in place. Thailand perceived tourism as a fast track to economic growth. The country did not see the need to make necessary investments in the industry. The Thai government need to make more efforts towards allowing local businesses to flourish and developing communities. New markets need to be created, which include low-skilled jobs for those locals on the poverty line. Jobs need to be made that combat unemployment in monsoon season as well. More education opportunities also need to be provided so the labour force is not condemned to solely low-skilled jobs. More government focus is also needed on standards of quality. Thailand needs to be brought into the first world. Modernization of experiences need to take place to keep up with the ever-changing tourism industry. Focus should be put on the protection of the natural environment. More wildlife and environmental policies need to be put in place to stop animals and locations being destroyed and exploited. By doing so, Thailand can create a sustainable, ethical method of animal tourism. More areas also need to be protected and be free from tourism to allow cultures to remain intact and so tourism does not take over the whole country and destroy it in the process. Many of the negative impacts from tourism occur when the amount of visitors is greater than the environment's ability to cope with the visitor volume. Reconstruction and regeneration need to take place for a more efficient use of Thailand. Social regeneration would also allow businesses to be more successful and have positive effects on drugs and crime. These negative effects would be brought to a minimum. Drugs and crime could also be reduced by providing counselling and help for individuals with real issues rather than throwing into overpopulated prisons just to go back on the streets and carry on the cycle of crime. I saw the effects tourism has to have on Thailand first hand when I visited the country last year. 
From the experience I had, the Thai people are some of the friendliest I've met, and their heritage is rich. I personally hope that tourism doesn't completely ruin the deep culture that runs through Thailand, and a sustainable method of tourism can be developed.